Welcome, Pisces. Welcome. I want to say thank you for being back, Pisces. Ooh, la, la. Pisces, it is a wonderful, wonderful week for you guys. Let's just do good. So, Pisces, it's going to be a really wonderful week for you um, guys. And this is for the people who have been really honest, honest, positive, and honest. Money is coming in. So I see um, some sort of a situation. Some of you Pisces who is doing dealing with someone overseas, they're investigating you. So if you're a Pisces living in another country, overseas, they are investigating you and your lover and your partner. So let's say um, um, that some of you Pisces have an, a, a, a new love or um, this is a page of emotion. Um, where some of you are dealing with a new love, someone from overseas, they're investigating this person. I see lawyers and a whole lot of people are investigating. Some of you Pisces wants to travel, but I see they're investigating whether or not you can. Um, and, um, I see, um, some sort of legal issues coming back from the past for you Pisces, especially Pisces that have uh, connected with, uh, someone overseas or if you're living in a country they're they're um investigating how you get to be in a country okay so i see this is coming up but it's more as if it's not really you that has been investigated but it's a young person whether it's your child or you have a young lover um they're investigating or a new love from another country they're investigating this person so I see um, whoever um, has a, a partner that is a Capricorn, go check out the Capricorn reading. If you or um, someone that is in a relationship with a Capricorn, married to a Capricorn, um, or um, you are connected with a Capricorn in some way, go check out the Capricorn reading. Um, basically, some sort of energies, the Ace of Pentac the Nine of Pentacles in the same place came up for the Capricorns, and the Ace of Pentacles in the same place came up for the Capricorns. So something is happening with you, Pisces, and the Capricorn. Some of you could be in love um, with a Capricorn, and you haven't heard from this person. You want this person to connect with you. Um, and you're trying to do all sort of the things, uh, but this person has uh, closed the door. Okay. Um, the nine of inspiration also came up, um, for the Capricorn in a Capricorn reading. So go and check out what is happening and what is transpiring. A whole lot of you, um, Capricorns there, um, who is connected with the Capricorns? I see, um, there has been some sort of a, situation that was transpiring and if your mom or your father whoever family member or you're in a relationship with a capricorn or married to a capricorn go check out their reading because this is going to be good all right so we see the ace of pentacles um the ace of pentacles um if you have your own business i see business is going to be coming in to you pisces who are really honest and open some sort of a Payment that was supposed to come in, some sort of money that was supposed to come in, finally, finally came in. Um, nine, 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 ninety-nine. So something is going to be ending. Some sort of a, um, something is going to be ended. Okay. Um, so be aware of that. Um, a corporation institution. You're going to be standing your ground against a corporation institution. The seven of uh, Fire is here where you're standing your ground um, against a corporation institution. I see you have the Ace of Pentacles. Some sort of a money could be returning or some of you Pisces business people could be have to be paying some sort of a money to a corporation institution. So what we're seeing here that is happening is that the nine of materialistic wealth. I see the nine of inspiration is coming in. I see the energy of uh, an air event, uh, um that is transpiring with uh, some sort of a business. So I see um, some of you Pisces who have a business is standing um, strong. Some of you Pisces are having some sort of an issue with a corporation institution. And some of you Pisces 
um, a Sagittarian, whoever the Sagittarian is, and you are under some sort of an investigation. Um, you Pisces that is connected with a Sagittarius and a Leo is under some sort of an investigation where a whole lot of money. Um, and some of you who are in a relationship with a Leo, they're investigating you and this Leo. If this Leo was from another country, they're investigating you and this Leo. So Monday is going to be good. Some sort of a money is coming in for you, um, Pisces. Um, from a Leo, a Leo has stolen a lot of money and the money is going to be returned. Um, so Monday is a good day for you guys. This week is actually a good week for you, Pisces. So it is a week. Um, whatever question, um, you like to answer is a yes. Okay. Only if it is something positive. Okay. So not that you are doing something negative to another person and you want to know if it's working. No, it's a no, it's not working. Um, so Monday is a hurt energy, so that is good. Monday is a good day for you guys. Tuesday is a lot that is going on, but you're standing your ground at work. Um, Wednesday this week is a week of that you're dealing with some sort of a corporation institution. And why is because some of you and your lover is connected to this, and especially whoever is dealing with Leo people. I see a corporation institution is uh, investigating this Leo. If this Leo is from another country, a corporation institution is investigating this Leo. Some of you are dealing with a Taurus on Wednesday. On Thursday, I definitely you're standing your ground. Whatever is transpiring, you're standing your ground and protecting your money. Um, Friday, good news is coming in. Money is coming back. Money is going to give a new start. So emotions is going to be great Saturday and Sunday. On Saturday, some of you are going to be receiving some sort of a news that some sort of a money is coming in, but let's see exactly what that is all about. So the nine of pentacles, yes, you're going to be receiving some money. Money is coming in to you on Monday. Okay, so that is good. So it could be pay. Um, your burdens, um, with money and nine and nine so you have um a double whammy so number nine energy something is going to be ending in this week for you pisces it could be the ending of your burdens financial burdens so i see um a situation with a taurus virgo or a capricorn man whoever this person is they're going to be protecting you from this man Yes, I see an end is coming up for this man. So it could be your boss uh, or someone at your work that could be leaving or you're turning your back on your father or your husband. This person is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. I see you're dealing, you ladies are dealing with a situation where you want to end a relationship with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man. This man has created a lot of burdens for you and problems and you're ending it. So you want a new start, okay? So this new start is going to be coming in for you. Ladies is going to be receiving some money. And this new start is going to be coming in for ladies um, 45 years and older. Um, some sort of a money is going to be returned. See, um, page of pentacles, ace of pentacles. Um, so message of uh, um, some sort of a money is going to be coming in. A corporation is going to be bringing in some sort of a money. Then we see the energy of the two of cups. And I see that some of you ladies are turning your back on a relationship that you were having. Some of you could be standing your ground, ending your marriage and moving forward. Um, some of you could be receiving message that your marriage has ended. A new offer of love is coming in. Page of emotion, a new offer of love is coming in. Um, if this love is coming in from a fire sign person, do not accept it. Um, if there was some sort of a legal issue, I see that uh, they are going to be resolving some sort of an issue and situation and it's offering you. I see um, the legal courts, the um, um, if some of you Pisces were on justly accused of something, I see um, they're going to be offering you a deal out. Okay, so if uh, you Pisces um, had some sort of a legal issue, they're going to be offering you a deal out. 
So the nine of pentacles, a lot of you are going to be receiving, especially Pisces women are going to be receiving a lot of money coming in in this week. And this money is going to be giving you Pisces woman a new start moving forward. Then we see some sort of a situation where you Pisces women are protecting yourself from a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn man. You have realized, realized that this, this Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn man has created some sort of an issue for you if you were in a relationship with this person. Some of you um, women are going to be um, asking your father for some sort of a financial help to get out of some sort of a problem in a corporation institution. Okay, so I see that some of you women, 50 years and older or 45 years and older, is going to be going to your father and asking your father for help um, to get out of some sort of a um, problem. It could be that you ladies hold some medicine bill and uh, um, you are going to your father, asking your father for some sort of a financial help to get you out of uh, some sort of a um, bill that you have to pay to a corporation institution. And it's coming up as a hospital okay um and 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 uh, um if your father because your father could be a virgo and your husband could be a virgo um and you're realizing that because of your virgo husband or partner they have created issues for you that created a whole lot of expense for you in a corporation institution and now I see you decide to end this relationship with this person because you realize that this person had only created issues, problem, extra expenses for you and you are ending this relationship. Um, then I see an end is coming up for a Sagittarian and a Libran. So, um, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man, a Sagittarian, and, and, and a Leo. Um, I see an end is coming up for these people. Um, mm, you. I see that you ladies want to reconnect with someone. This is like a sister, and you want to reconnect with this person. Maybe it's a family member, but it comes up as a sister. This person has been so good to you. And um, it's as if your partner came between you and this person and you want to regain balance and stability in order to regain connection with you and this person because you really miss this person. You really um, miss this person in such a way um, that you do not want this relationship, not because of money, that you both do not communicate. Okay, so I see... Um, you Pisces lady want to resolve this. So as we look, I see you Pisces lady, your partner is on the investigation. And I see um, they are going to be, I see you could be leaving your partner. Your partner is deciding to move away from you. So be aware of this. Um, some of you are going to be finding out that um, your partner was only in a relationship for money. Some of you Pisces lady, if you had married to a Taurus, Virgo or a Capricorn, you're going to be regretting this. And I see divorce is finally over. And it's like Saturday, you're going to be receiving the letter in the mail that divorce is finally over. Whatever that some of you had um, uh, asked for in a lawsuit, I see that they're going to be offering you. So let's say that there was an accident and there was some sort of a settlement. They're going to be offering you a settlement and uh, you're going to be taking the what they offered you. You're going to be um, taking the settlement that they offered you, okay? So um, this is going to be good. Now, men, you seems to be, uh, some of you Pisces men, not all of you, Pisces men that was doing some sort of a trickster or trickery or using witchcraft um, to control or connect with someone, this is going to be over, okay? It's as if the universal angels and guides is coming in and said, no, nope, no more. Whatever and however you were using trickery 
in order to control a situation or a problem or some sort of a legal issue, you men are going to be feeling the, the karmatic effect of what you have done. Okay, you could be feeling it, your parents could be feeling it, your kinder, your children could be feeling it. But whatever karma that you had sent out um, to someone else is going to be returning. Um, burdens are, some of you have some sort of a financial burdens that you're going to be reaching out to your father um, for some sort of a help. And um, you will receive this money and this money is going to, you're going to be paying off a corporation and hoping to have some sort of and standing your ground and hoping to have some sort of a connection um with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn but be, is uh, and you miss this person because uh, you miss the connection with this person this person is coming up as a sister or a, someone who you dearly deeply love but it's a younger person than you and it's not a relationship it's more of uh, you know you're like my sister i will never I should have never done you this wrong or I should not have treated you the way I treated you. And I see that it's as if you're recognizing because it's as if you're thinking if I had done better to this person, this person could have been here now. So this is really a young a young person that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and you really miss this sister or this daughter and you're, you know, you're open to resolve some sort of a situation so that um, this person can regain and return in your life. There is some sort of a investigation or some of you who are, I see um, it's as if an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra is going to be coming back. This person and is going to be coming back in your life and take this. I don't know. Oh God. I don't know. Ooh. I don't know. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I can't say, but this person is going to be offering you love. It's like you and this person have some sort that of, was married. This could be an ex. And this person is coming back to show you love. This person wants to reconnect with you and either remarry you. So be aware of this, ladies, because I see this person is as if because this person was either ex-lover or ex-husband and this person wants to return. But this person is returning because they are financially on the ground. And that is the reason why and you just let go someone who was draining you financially. So you really don't need this. You need love. Call upon your sister or brother. They always forgive you. Okay. But I see love is being offered to you. Um, Pisces, new love is, is, is been offered to you. And, um, whoever was going through some financial hardship and, you know, it's as if you were thrown to the wolves. Um, balance is going to be coming in. I don't know that I'm, you know, I'm getting something about Pisces men that is not very good. I don't know what you Pisces men have been doing and how you have been using negative forces in order to control other people and control situation. I see that this is going to be ending. And when it ends, it is going to be ending, but it's going to be moving towards other members in your family. So whatever you had created for someone, that's what I'm receiving. And that is two times. But for the rest, I see that this is a really good week where you, um, Pisces, are standing your grounds and creating some sort of issue. Gotta go.